Keep the cold at bay with our winter warmer recipes. Nou, sê, welkom terug, dit is jy is ingeskakel hier by Expresso op SABC3, terug in die kombuis, sal my die lieflike Zola, ons maak a curry of note this morning. It's going to oh, yes. be amazing, if you can't try this out, remember the keyword for our curry uh, early on was curry, 2, 3, 3, 7, 2, 8, but now we're making the rice to go with it. The rice to go with it, yes. It's called and the rice pilau, a, or pilaf. A pilau or pilaf, so it, it both, okay. both words mean the same thing. Okay, what um, is it? It's basically like a fragrant rice dish, so you could serve this curry because it's so flavorful with just steamed rice, okay. or you could make this pilaf or pilau, and take it to the next level, because you know okay. that's what we like to do here. <laughs> okay. Next level stuff, <laughs> next level. absolutely. So here I've got some coconut oil, or you could use regular vegetable oil, yeah. or you could use some um, uh, olive oil. Yeah. Then I'm going to add some black mustard seeds. I like the black mustard seeds because they speckle the rice. Uh, so you could use yellow mustard seeds, but they sort of, they get yeah. lost in the in the rice because we're going to add some turmeric. Okay. So what you want to do is actually cook these um, in the oil Don't until they start, they, like popping? they start popping, exactly. Ah, yes. But I'm going to just fast forward this process and add some onions. Thank you. Okay. All right. So onions go in. I'm going to add a little bit more oil, coconut oil, actually, because it smells so great and it yeah. tastes so good. And great. coconut oil is a healthy oil as well. It is. Which it you is. Can use. Yeah. Absolutely. I'm a big yeah, fan of coconut and oil. And it's very popular, actually. People yes. use it all the time instead of all sorts of things. And Absolutely. People, I've replaced all my cooking, uh, you know, with when I cook whatever at home, I always try and use coconut oil, whether that's making eggs or even like trying to my hand out a curry or anything. Yeah. People sometimes put a, a spoonful in their coffee, even. What? I know. Okay, wait, well, that's weird. Yeah. Why? <laughs> Because it tastes nice. I don't know. Um, and have, you, then, have you put coconut oil in your coffee? I would love to know that. <laughs> Comment on our Facebook page, Express the Morning Show, SABC3. That is the most interesting thing I've heard in this Friday morning. It is, hey. And then I'm going to add some um, turmeric. Yes. That's going to give our rice a beautiful yes. yellow colour and makes it just look festive, which we love. Right. Festive and, then and I've got fancy. Festive and fancy. Then I've got some um, basmati rice. Uncooked. Completely. Uncooked, completely raw. Or you could use jasmine rice. Um, or you could use brown rice. It just takes a bit longer to cook. Um, but I like a long grain rice because it's a little fluffier and more delicious to eat with the curry. It absorbs okay. more of the sauce, which I yes. love. Okay, then and to then? this, I'm going to add stock. One pot rice to three pot stock. Remember we had that argument yesterday? I say, yeah, I'm not going to continue <laughs> with that. But yeah. <laughs> so... So, so one pot rice, three parts water or three stock? Pot, yeah, so I use stock just to add extra flavor. You can just use water, what, what that's fine too. This stock you um, This is chicken stock. Chicken stock, right. Chicken stock's like the most neutral stock and the most used in a kitchen. Okay. You could use vegetable stock if you like, if you're vegetarian. Or you could even use fish stock because we're using we're doing a fish curry. Yes. Um, always season your rice very generously. Then at this point, right. you're going to put a lid on. My you, lid's disappeared. You put uh, a lid it's, on, it's, it's, pretend. <laughs> <laughs> I had it right there, and that's good. <laughs> Put a lid on, simmer it for about 10 minutes, okay? Then turn it off, but leave it on the heat. Okay. But the heat is off, do you know what I mean? So leave oh, so, it on, so, so turn on the it hot off, off. area. Yeah, so turn turn the heat off, but just leave it where it is. Okay. Le leave the lid on, and then just leave it to sort of steam for about five minutes before you eat it. Oh, wow. Okay, okay. now we're going to serve up. So there right. it is. Listen, some, your curry on that side is boiling. I remember yeah, this don't, don't worry about my curry. I I'm just you. saying, I'm just, wow, look at this. There's the rice. So you dish up some rice for us, and I'll dish up some curry. Okay, I'll dish up. Look at this rice here. It looks amazing. Doesn't it look delicious? All right. Any any fancy way you want me to dish out no, this no, rice? You, you do what you do, and I'll just pop some prawns on. Oh, that curry smells oh. amazing. Listen, if you want to get your hands on the recipe for our um, rice pilau or pilaf, like, uh, Zola also says you can SMS the keyword dinner to 33728. That's dinner to 33728. Wow. Look at that. Quick who, and easy curry. Who would be curry. disappointed if they got that for dinner? No one would be disappointed. No. Graham would be because he can't eat the prawns. But That's it's fine, true. Graham. It's okay, we've got sauce for you, Graham. <laughs> <laughs> Listen, once again, um, our keyword for the prawn curry that we made earlier, that is curry to 33728. And for our rice, if you want to SMS or you want to make that, you can just SMS the keyword um, dinner to 33728. SMS cost 1 Rand 50. Those T's and C's do apply, but you'll get the ingredients list and also a link to the recipe that you can go follow. Zola, thank you very much. Such a pleasure. Just adding a little bit of I'm heat to our Friday. Today. I always share, but today it's all for me. I've got this whole pot, pot thing and that whole pot thing, so I'm good. Eh? You can have okay. that. That's Thank fine. I <laughs> love it. Love it. There we go. Your br uh, brilliant little winter warmer from the Espresso Kitchen on this Friday morning. But lots more beautiful recipes you can expect on Afternoon Express. Zoe, what do you have?